teach his team how to learn to win. And they've got Kozowski, who is a star in this league, but the rest of this team still is trying to figure it out. And so is she. She's having a tough game and see how she responds to it. The third quarter, it's been a pretty comfortable quarter for Bucknell this season, outscoring the opposition by 104 points. They start with the basketball, and 14 seconds in, it's Kate Walker who chimes in with a bucket. She now has eight, so she's nine points away from the 1,000-point plateau. We'll keep that in mind. Great to be alongside Blake Dodonis. I'm Justin Answell. Bucknell feeding off this home crowd. Martino off the mark, and Walker tracks it down. Need to see Martino get going a little bit. We barely even said her name the first 20 minutes. Yeah, she's just been in a bit of a rut from outside lately. And look at this. Perfect high-low. Slagas had the seal. The pass is there. And Lafayette just kind of falling apart defensively. This is a good defensive team, and Bucknell having their way with them. 13 assists on 17 field goals made for Bucknell. Impressive. Johnson gliding through traffic. Afida Martino comes up short on the hook, cleared by Cap. Bucknell off and running. This is a really well-conditioned team, too, and they really worked on that with new strength coach Matt Bainey in the offseason so they could play that transition style that you talked about. And when you have a bench like Bucknell does where you're comfortable putting in your players and you can go nine or even ten deep and you open up the possibilities to do that as they work inside. But, yeah, so the deeper the numbers to go, obviously the more flexibility you have in the type of game you can play. And I think what stands out most with this Bucknell team is they've been receiving everybody's knockout punch. Everybody gets up to play Bucknell this year, and it can be taxing for this team, but like you said, the depth kind of compensates for that. That's a big three for Nicole Johnson. It's the fourth three of the game for the Leopards. Well, I think it helps, too, when you have a team that has multiple players that can shoulder the load. You look at a Lafayette, for example, if Kozowski doesn't have a big game, they struggle to win. And you wonder if that weighs on her a little bit as just a sophomore, too. But Bucknell, if Slagus is off or Walker is off, you got English, you've got other players that are able to step up. So I think that really helps him, too. Another high-low. And how about Slagus returns the favor to Mac? It's a great job. And Mac noticed there was a switch. She had the smaller defender on her as Nicole Johnson came over on her. She posted her up, called for the ball, and that's exactly right. Return the favor, please. That's Russell's goal. Make the opposition burn the first time out of the third quarter. 